What's up, guys? Hey, guys. Can you know, I guess where we're going? Look, look at this, look at this sexy cubs, man. Yeah, baby. So we're headed out, uh, drive into my cousin's house, gonna park the car, and then we're gonna take the train into Wrigley to go yeah. see our first Cubs game. I know. So excited. It's pretty exciting. I wish Robert was with us, but he is right now in Atlanta, Georgia, yep. on his way to Florida. He's so. flying to Florida, so. Uh, he was a little, he didn't know how to act yesterday. <laughs> It was funny. He was Good. like, freedom. I don't know what that is. He, he doesn't. And then he would. Say, he said something about, um, he kept on saying, yeah. He'll say, yeah. And then he, I mean, yes. Yes. Yes, ma'am. He actually said, yes, ma'am, to his mom. He said, yes, ma'am. I was like, I was like <laughs> who is this child? <laughs> the military has made him a proud man. He doesn't. And he was looking at Ezekiel's phone, and he was like, I don't even know how to use this. <laughs> like, that was funny. So, yeah. All right. <laughs> so, we're headed out. We're headed we're out. We're leaving. Later. All right, got the old parking done. So, uh, walking back to my cousin's. I don't know how many blocks down I am, but we'll find it. <laughs> Foremost liquors. I think my cousin went to the liquor store. I wonder what she bought us. We'll see. <laughs> Pretty cool. Right. You can hear my cousin's voice. We have to protect her identity at all costs. Yes. She's she's Secret Service, Covert. FBI, CIA, <laughs> KGB, Malort drinker. M Malort drinker. Oh, she brought the Malort. Look, we got it. You can just go do it. Oh, 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 oh my God! So here's the view from my cousin's apartment. That's the brown line. That's what we're taking. Look, she lives right here. Literally, we get on right here. Uh, look at this view. There's the Chicago skyline right there. Oh my goodness. <laughs> People I know are gonna lose their shit right now. They're like, Malort. sure, might take some of this. Malort. You can go down the street and just Malort. get it. You can just buy this stuff on the streets. <laughs> what the heck? There's actual, there's actual Malort dealers on the streets. <laughs> So, uh, yeah, so let's, uh, Bottoms so, up. Oh, I think you have to dead cheers. Malort, I'll have another. Oh yeah, Malort, cheers, I'll have another, right? Malort, okay. Okay, okay. Malort. Malort. I'll have another. Cheers, guys. I, <laughs> I gotta get her reaction to this. Oh yeah. I'll get, have get another. It. Get it. Ooh. Get it. Oh, oh God. God, she's dying. Hit the chaser. Oh. All right, guys, cheers. Here you go. Oh, oh God. Uh. Malort. Malort. Swedish cuisines and spirits both suck. Tastes like an abortion clinic in Iceland. It's a product of a gypsy curse. Oh god. Uh... What time is it? Uh, well, since... <laughs> oh, well, is that bad? It's so good. All right, we're hitting the. Uh... Hard seltzers. We're in the hard seltzer, and I got I got another shot of Malort because yeah. I'm stupid. Mad but man. you know what? We're in Chicago, and we're going to a Cubs game. I'm drinking all yeah. the damn Malort. Look, we got this bottle right there. We, we can't just I let it. I thought she was getting like little sugar. No, no. Why like, would she no, do that? No, I'm I'm buying the whole thing. Look, it was twenty. It was twenty-seven ninety-nine. You buy that shit online. It's way more than that. So. Yeah. So uh, cheers to Liberty and Mark because they're awesome. And Love you guys. Fun, phenomenal. Love you. <laughs> we got shot three of Malord here. Look at this. That's right here. Three for you. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, I'll show him. Look, look, look at that hair. He's, like, he's like an Adonis. He's like a Greek god. <laughs> the, flow, the hockey hair. <laughs> I gotta keep her undercover, but look at her, look at her hair. Oh my god. Look at this good here. Malord, it'll put hair on your chest. Oh, it's a gypsy curse. Oh my. Oh. Look. Oh. Too dumb for New York City, too oh, ugly for LA. Oh, I can't have any more. Have Three shots deep. Let's go to a cup game. Yo, we're taking the train. I haven't taken the train since Soldier Field. 2014. I'm a little drunk. So how you feeling? I'm a little drunk. We got it. Three shots, shots of Malort. Three shots of Malort. I'm a little drunk. I've had three. I'm a little, but it's not drunk. When in Rome, when in Chicago, you drink Malort before the Cubs game. Let's go. All right, really, it's cool. 
Okay. So this is Southport, you said? It's, yep. Southport. Southport. This is cool. Hey, there's J. Crew. Yeah. That's where Neil used to work. But it's like, okay. have you ever seen Not a Barbie yeah. Parker in person? Yeah. Lush. Hey, babe, look, they got Lush. You need a bath bomb? You need a bath bomb? I don't have time for a bath. Bath bombs. Look, we ain't got no time for no bath. So beautiful. A Capital One Cafe, look, look, look. You can get your coffee, your cafe, and your banking done at all times. Walk into Wrigley. These nice brick architect architectures. I want to come live here, Liberty. Move here. He won't move it's away from Vegas. <laughs> Vegas? I'm over in California. The type of job I do is... I don't, I don't work in the it's snow. Like oh, here's Guthrie's. Established 1986. Let's go. Don't let anyone say that it's just a game. For I've seen other teams and it's never the same When you're born in Chicago, you're blessed and you're healed The first time you walk into Wrigley Field Our heroes wear pinstripes, heroes in blue Give us the chance to feel like heroes too Forever we'll win and if we should lose We know someday we'll go all the way yeah, someday we'll go all the way. We are one with the Cubs, with the Cubs we're in love. Yeah, hold our head high as the underdogs. We are not fair weather, but foul weather fans. Like brothers in arms in the streets and the stands. There's magic in the ivy in the old scoreboard The same when I stared at as a kid keeping score In a world full of greed I could never want more And someday we'll go all the way
took the lead. We're winning. My Chicago Sports Street might be over. Hopefully. One out to go. We're gonna win. Hopefully. Not yet. All right, last out. Come on, come on. Yeah, there it is! There it is! Holy shit! Oh! Go, go, go! Chicago, what do you say? Go, go, go! Chicago, what do you say? Look at that, a true Cubs fan, scattered ashes in the ivy. Evening. Hey guys. We, just, we have come to the end. The end of a four day trip. Yes. Illinois trip. The end of the trip, the end of day four. Mm -hmm. We may or may not have gone to a Cubs game, which I'm sure y'all saw all the clips. So, you know, on a personal level, bucket list item for me. Almost 46 years old. Never been to Wrigley. And I got to go to Wrigley Field today with the wife, the kid, and my cousin Liberty and Mark, which was awesome. Yeah. So it was awesome meeting them and I got hanging to, out. Yeah. Got to take the train today. She bought us more Lord. Your first time on the, yeah. And as y'all saw, we had to have, we had to, we had to pregame with my Lord. Oh God, that was so, uh, yeah, shout out to all those Malort lovers. But, you know, when in Rome, but in Chicago, you, you got to get buzzed on Malort before the game, right? But uh, the game was good. I checked a lot of items off my list. I got to, uh, A, go to Wrigley Field. B, I got to see uh, somebody throw a home run ball back from the opposite team, which is awesome. Uh, got me a good Wrigley Chicago dog. Very delicious. Very good prices too. Good prices, yes. Yeah, I got to uh, sing "Take Me Out to the Ball Game" in the bottom of the or uh, between the mid, between the top and bottom of the seventh inning, which was awesome. They had uh, Carrie Wood singing it. Mm -hmm. It was twenty five years ago today that he threw that twenty strikeout masterpiece. So he was there. And then the Cubs got the dub, so they got the fly the W, fly the dub. Yep. And we got the sing Go Cubs Go at the end there. So, what a great day. We had great weather. This one got a little bit. Look, look she has a watch whiteness. And her chest got a little burnt. Because it was, a uh, when we were driving in, there was a little bit of chance of rain. It was raining. We got to my cousin's and it, it was just overcast. Then we got to the game. The clouds broke, you know, because, you know, God wanted to put sunshine down upon the old cubbies there. Mm-hmm. <laughs> But, you know, when it's overcast and then it's kind of humid, then that sun comes out. It's like, it's quite the immense heat. It's weird because it's not really hot. I mean, it could have been more than maybe, I think it topped out maybe 73 degrees, but it felt hot when that sun came out. So. It did. I was like, maybe I should wear shorts. It's that Midwestern humidities. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. But the game was awesome. The Cubs won my first time at Wrigley. So, I'm glad I got to share it with the wife and my cousin Liberty. And Mark, who, you know, the aforementioned, uh, when we pulled up, you know, we're like, hey, we're here, we're parking. They're like, hey, we're at the liquor store getting Malort. <laughs> now that's good family, right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, in all in all, this whole trip was amazing. Yeah. My number one was seeing my son graduate. I went, I actually snuck up on him and he couldn't move because, you know, he's military. He can't can't look before the graduation and he saw me out of the corner of his eye and you can see his smirk he was smirking he knew that it was me so yeah all the navy moms travel as a pack to go see their kids <laughs> sitting up in the bleachers who can't who can't turn their heads can't look anywhere <laughs> me and gretchen we went down there to see our boys because our boys kind of i think they sit next to each other so it was amazing we loved yeah. it. so 
It was good. It was a good trip. Got to see Chicago. We got to go see all the cool, you know, we went to uh, Navy Pier, ate at Harry Carey's, went to Millennium Park. Just got to chill out, you know. Yeah. Um, Robert got surprised not only by us, but by his girlfriend. He was so happy. You know? Yeah. That just, just has seen the happiness on him. It's just. He didn't want to go. He didn't want to go away from us. He he wanted to come with us and not go back. And yeah, he I, said, I'll, I'll get arrested. Yeah, Unfor or, uh, <laughs> un unfortunately, we didn't know if he would have him on Saturday. But his orders were he left in the middle of the night last night. Like one. Um. So he's already in Pensacola, Florida. So he wasn't able to go to the game with this. Um. But yeah, he was sad. So we had a good day. I mean, Thursday was awesome with all the Chicago stuff. Just wandering around the city. So pretty. Um. Friday with the graduation, today with being able to see my cousin and the Cubbies. Go Cubs, go. Hey, Chicago, what do you say? Go Cubs, go. I think the Cubbies won today. Yes, they did. Y'all saw my terrible singing earlier, so. Yeah. Anyway, we're getting out of here. Uh, we have a really early middle. We have to leave here in like 3 a.m. We got to go take the rental car back, drive back to O'Hare. Oh, we'll drop the rental car off, take the shuttle over to O'Hare, get ourselves checked. Well, well, not checked in, but um, we already have our boarding passes, bath, poof, boarding passes, but, you know, we just got to wake up early. But on the positive side, we landed Ontario, California at 1020 in the morning. So we got the whole day. Laundry, naps. I already see my future. <laughs> That's how I see my future. I see my future of cleaning. So, uh, <laughs> yeah, the cats have probably taken over. Yeah. So, uh, yeah. So from us, from our Chicago trip, we appreciate y'all. I hope you guys enjoyed following along um, all four days. Mm -hmm. It was a blast. I'm glad we got to show it to you guys. And yes. So we will see you at the next trip, guys. Bye, y'all. Bye. Look there, brother, baby, and I'll see what I...